Calhoun here. Hope you're having a wonderful day. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create perfect, literally perfect every single time, photo to AI videos using the software, photoaivideo.com. And it's really powerful, really cool. And in this video, I'm going to show you the pro tips, what you need to know. Okay. You don't want to miss what I'm about to tell you because it's going to make your consistently, consistently, it's going to make you create consistent, perfect, Dolly zoom videos, zooming through a space, even with very little experience, you're going to make your photos turn to videos using our AI tool called photo AI video. It's really, really cool. All right. So let's get into it. All right. Step one, go to photo AI video.com and click the app login button. You'll see a dashboard looks just like this. You're going to create a project. Now, when you create a project, you have to upload videos or upload images into that project. Now you want to probably upload one at a time, but be thinking about what's my start frame and my end frame. So I'm going to show you this in a whole, whole walkthrough video in a moment. Um, but first, this is just how you get started. You add a, you add a photo um, and that's how it looks. So let me jump into some examples shown before and after. And I hope you enjoy it. And of course, check us out at photoaivideo.com. Okay, let me jump back in here. So I click select image and I have listing photos here. So my first photo, my starting photo, where I want to be is right. I think it's this one. No, it's this one here. Here we go. So I'm going to add this to a project. Okay. Now it goes in from my image upload area into my first generation image generation section. Now you'll notice a button right here that says add end frame. This is a very important button because it tells the AI where to go. Where should I end up? Instead of inferring or guessing, where do you want me to go to? Now, the best case scenario is when you have two images, your first image and your second image have overlapping content, which means the content is either uh, in part overlapping, so you have some information for it to go off of, or it's just the same uh, stuff inside of it, and it's going to infer how to get to it from one place to the next. So I'm going to keep this default Dolly Zoom prompt here. I can add more stuff in here if I want to, but for now I'm just going to click um, Generate Video and let the, I, the AI do its work. Now, as this is generating, I'm going to upload a couple more images for my next bathroom example, uh, where I'm going to do an orbit to the right. I'm gonna let this load really quick and give it a minute. Okay, so this first image has generated and uh, let's go ahead and check out the output. So great. So we're basically creating a dolly zoom effect with the two before and after images. And as you can see from the video, it's extremely clear and smooth because we're giving it more information that connects to each other. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you how to do this at more of a... Um, orbit to the left type mode. So we're going to select an image. In this case, I'm going to pick a bathroom image. Okay, this is my before image here. Now remember, we are creating videos via AI. So we have to have a start frame and an end frame. And we got to give it a prompt of what the AI should do. What should the camera movement be for the photo AI video product? Okay, look. So actually, before I even show you, let me just open up real quickly these images may be a little bit larger so you can see kind of what they look like and um, what to expect from the video. So I'm going to do a quick look here. So this is a bathroom image from Keith Project. Now typically these are hard to get with no reflection, right? Check this out. And there's the end frame image I'm going to use. So quickly I'm going to look at it. Quick look. Cool. So this is the bathroom. It's just two different angles of it, right? And keep in mind, I haven't even... Um, press anything here. I just know like from the input or I haven't even tested this out. What I'm saying is I know that from adding these two inputs and adding the movement. So I'm going to change this dolly zoom. I'm going to remove this. I'm going to add the movement. And this is a bunch of movement types. I'm going to say orbit to the right. And all that means is you start from the left and burn to the right. Okay. That's all that or right, right means. So I'm going to click generate, um, give it a few seconds here and then come back whenever it is finished. Okay, so we finished generating. I'm going to click play and give it a look. All right, cool. Just like that, it orbits to the right. It connects the two photos perfectly. 
Um, and it's kind of interesting is it even closed the door for me as I'm moving, which is literally physically impossible by yourself, <laughs> unless you have somebody behind the door. So really, really cool. It just orbits to the left or the right. And now we have a usable video for a upcoming property video. So really, really cool. So this is how you basically guarantee you're going to get quality outputs every time. Just like they always say, quality in, quality out, right? So if you give it a lot of weird inputs or maybe there's no overlapping in the start frame, the end frame, the AI is gonna guess a lot more. But in this case, it's actually a great example, even without doing any tests or like pre-examples before I recorded the video, basically I just made sure I had a good start frame and an end frame that overlapped and the output looks incredible, usable and ready to get, ready to get started. So um, if you just take a moment, Go to photoaivideo.com, um, check out some examples, make sure you click app login, get started. It's, it's free to try, free to get started. Log in, start generating some videos. And of course, um, if you wanna unlock your generations bundle, um, you can do that with payment. Okay, and download those and start making your video today. And of course, go make some more money in your real estate media endeavors. All right, hope you're having a great day. Um, enjoy this and of course, Send me all your cool, fun examples. I want to see who can make the best out with this really, really cool tool. And then uh, let's let's do it together. All right, photoaivideo.com.